How to use Behance Behance tutorial for beginners Hello guys and welcome to today's video For today's video, we will be exploring the creative world of Behance and show you how to use this platform to showcase your work, gain exposure, and connect with like-minded creatives Behance is a leading online platform for creative professionals to showcase their portfolios, share their work, and discover inspiration. Whether you're a graphic designer, illustrator, photographer, or any other type of creatives, Behance provides a powerful platform to showcase your talent and attract potential clients and collaborators. In this tutorial, we'll guide you through the basics of setting up your Behance profile creating and organizing your portfolio, and optimizing your projects for maximum impact. We'll also, we'll also explore the different features and tools available on Behance. So, uh, let's get started. Now, before we start with the exploration or before we dive into how we could use Behance, what exactly is Behance used for? Behance is mainly used as an online platform for creative professionals to showcase their portfolio and share their work with a global audience. That's what we are going to show you later on, how you will be able to build up and upload your portfolio for everyone to see in Behance. It serves as a hub for artists, designers, photographers, illustrators, and other creatives to exhibit their projects, connect with potential clients and collaborators, and discover inspiration from the work of others. Behance allows users to create visually appealing portfolios, organize their projects into various categories, and receive feedback and appreciation for Behance community. It is commonly used as a tool for self-promotion, professional networking, and gaining exposure in the creative industry. Now let's begin with our exploration or our overview of how you could use Behance. Now right now, we are currently in Behance.net and I have logged into my account. If you don't have an account yet, you can easily log in or create an account through this profile section over here. Now right now, what we are looking at is the For You section. Like, on honor, like in any other social media platform, For You sections are projects or videos or even any item that is recommended to you. Depending on what type of person you are, this will change. Uh, the more you use Behance and the more Behance learn from how you operate, the more Behance learns what type of things you're interested in. For example, you're more interested in graphic design. When you first create your account in Behance, of course, it doesn't know that you like graphic design. But the more you use Behance, the more it will know graphic design is what you're interested in, the more it will show Behance, the more it will show graphic designs on the For You page. As you can see here, there are a lot of different things. There are even designs for websites in this section. And these are the different portfolios of the different works of other people, different artists around the world. As you can see here, this person, Jack Watson, is from Cleveland, USA. Wade Akuf is from USA as well. And Maddie Belwer is from the Netherlands. And each and everyone has their own design and unique take on how they would present themselves to the world. As you can see here, and all of this are pretty unique they have their own design and it depends on how they would like to be presented and it is complete up to them as you can see here this is a logo i really like this design over here also it's a very unique logo when you click on a design you will be able to see like a close-up of the design you will be able to choose more like this you will be able to see similar designs of this or designs of the creator as you can see here you could also save this for yourself you could follow the creator you could message them click on save or add to motherboard and or you could add a appreciation for this specific design over here you can see more designs as you scroll down over here one by one as you can see you could also check out other things this is just an example like a logo you could check out maybe this one you could check out what this is about as you can see we're going to wait for it to load you can see it's more on like a website design most likely as you can see here, there is an animation over here, loading animation, cont, and all of this are amazing designs that people are sharing to the community so that people will be exposed and like people would know what it would look like. This is the creator's way or the artist's way to showcase their work. 
they're going to display it on the gallery of peahands for the community to see you can see here also the different tools that you could use we have illustrator photoshop after effects and stock over here now moving on as you can see here like what we saw earlier we have different categories over here on the top that you could check out maybe for graphic designs we could check this out in behance you can look for people to hire or you could apply for people to hire you basically uploading in behance is like what i said earlier showcasing your work so people that other than other users has the chance to hire you if ever they like the design that you have created it's a chance for people to look for talents like yourselves and hire them for different jobs that they are looking for for example here on the hire section this is where you can hire other creatives to design something for you depending on what you would need so you can see here we have creative fields over here on the left side you have ui designs photography other types of design fashion arts and all of those options and if you want to hire someone or are you're looking for a professional to create something for you you could go here on the hire section for the job section you could look for and look through the different freelancing job over here you could post it over here and people would apply to the job that you have posted you could look for freelance full-time and creatives for hire over here now how do you share your own work in behance you can simply click on share your work over here and you could build up your project your service work in progress and live stream your work directly on your desktop for now we're going to go with the project and over here this is where you will be able to add your project you can simply add contents like image text photo grid video embed lightroom nft prototype and 3d over here depending on what type of person you are what type of work you have what type of output you create you're going to add it over here for now we're going to add a random image we're going to go with this image over here this is like an image for us to use then you could add a text over here like cat artwork stuff like that you could add anything you would like to add and like you could add more images a photo grid lightroom like what i said earlier now after this you can simply attach some assets over here if you would like attach some assets you could add them over here the file and add link over here and after uploading and after doing that you can simply give a title to your artwork for example cut artwork stuff like that then add to project tags you could add cat animal make sure that your tags are direct and not a general so that people would be able to identify or if people are looking for a person who created a cat they will be able to see one of your artworks so you have to be very specific they could put whatever tags is applicable to your artwork and as you can see the project tags are only up to 10 so be careful with what you choose you can also see what would you categorize this project you could have like graphic design behance visibility private or everyone depends on you uh you have copyright and license over here you could change this to all of this different license over here and you could also check the content if this project contains adult content and you could also add co-owners credits and more and after that you can simply publish this into behance and people will be able to see your artwork in behance just like what we saw earlier you, they will be able to see it on their for you page or all of those stuff for now we're going to save this as a draft and you could go back and go back to behance homepage over here to check out the different things if you are looking for something specific you can click on the search bar this is for 3d twitch overlay presentation fashion calendar or you see projects images prototypes people assets and all of those options like people to hire it is completely up to you on how you would like to use behance behance is very um Behance is a very amazing platform and I think if you're a graphic designer and you would like to be exposed or have some exposure not just for any not just for any graphic designer anything that involves creating something or uh, creating a design you could use Behance to showcase your work to the world and that's it guys hope you enjoyed the video thanks for watching